Hello darlings, this is to show you and to clear up just the importance of these triple goddess phases of the black moon and full moons. We've got two black moons and two full moons. The next one on Halloween, not the 28th like I said yesterday, on Halloween and then at midnight. So Cinderella, pumpkin and then we have for the election the waning gibbous, the monkey the last tusk <clears throat> that comes in Libra as we've got Mercury going from Libra back to Virgo. So let me show you. On the 16th of the 9th, we had a black moon. We had a black moon. Let's get this sun. So that sun is still in Leo on the 16th. It's right on the cusp. It's right on the cusp. So it's, you know, this is, it's right on that cusp. And here comes the moon. Yeah, by the time, yeah, it's now in Virgo. It's now in Virgo. So it was the 17th. On the 17th, we had the first black moon in Virgo. Then on the 1st of October, 1st of October, we had a full moon. Okay, the moon is opposite in Pisces. So this is the axis we're ending, this is the age we're ending, and this is Cinderella. Um, so let me just show you. So that's the full moon on the 1st. And then we have tomorrow... On the 16th, another black moon on Spica as Mercury is about to come back into Virgo from Libra, Judgment. So black moon here. And then we have on Halloween, here's Mercury. Mercury is going to be right conjunct. It's just moving out. Mercury's going to be on speaker, and we've got another full moon just at midnight. It is still in Virgo. It's still in Virgo. So mainstream, you know, obviously it's going to be for them in Libra, but that is two full moons, two black moons. So that means... That means that we've got on either side of the black moon the tusks of the bull. So they bring up the minotaur. They bring up um, they bring up the bully, the half man, half beast. Uh, for all those people who can't um, <clears throat> get through the Jupiter uh, merging spirit to flesh back again to come back into the Twin Peaks. This is bringing up the bull, the tusks. And then we've got, on Halloween at midnight, pumpkin, a pumpkin explosion. Uh, 369, the line broke, the monkey. We have a waning gibbous, that slither that we see in the high priestess. We see that tusk. That task of turning her into the War of Babylon this is the Bridget Jones. This is the Joe Bidden. This is the um, Boris Johnson. And so let me just let me just show you so that uh, phases. So this is going to be the last trumpet. This is the horn. This is the horns with the last tusk, Seros, rhinoceros. So the Rhine. In Germany, merging the red, white, and blue, because this is the blue, this is the blue uh, part. So we've got the red, we've got Europe, Scorpio, we've got America, red air, and we've got Africa, black. And this saltus should go from um, Scotland through England through to Africa. And they are merging the red, white, and blue for France to create her into the La Marianne and the bully uh, that um, 
this, you know, the Madonna creature that they've created all these years, and everybody phoning the 111, the NHS, these are the three legs, this is the 777, the LLL, the VVV, uh, this makes the bully, because the moon rules Cancer, so they're bringing up the original Saltis axis, Cancer Cali, uh, Capricorn, because the moon rules um, cancer, the, the cancer is ruled by the moon, and the moon is in exaltation in the bull. We have the moon between the two tusks, which is exactly what we've got in Virgo. We bring up the Minotaur. We bring up the half man, half beast. We bring up bring up Sinbad. And Sinbad the sailor, he has a one eye and a tusk. Uh, and this is bringing up the seven headed beasts. This is bringing up Europe to take over. So they've created uh, everything, everything for now. Um, this is the, the merging of Africa, Europe, and America. Um, and of course, Asia's in it as well, uh, through Jupiter and Sagittarius, all the boys still in uh, Sagittarius. So this is massive, this is massive. And this, you see, let's go to the election, two, three. So we go look at the moon. Oh, and holy shit, that moon is there. And this is bringing up the last horn. So if we look at that moon, you'll see Get it right onto Aldebaran. There it is, that slither. That slither, the waning gibbous. I'm the king of the swingers. Yeah, the jungle VIP. This is the gibbous, the gibbon, the orangutan. That's why the tartuffe. We've got the um, Oregon. Uh, look, this is it. This is the last trumpet. So something's going to happen to Trump and Joe Biden, J.B., Bridget Jones. Uh, they're bringing up the Whore of Babylon and uh, the Minotaur. Mentos. Here we go. This is it. Clockwork Orange, making everyone go absolutely crazy. Um, and yesterday we celebrated uh, it's two and a half years. They had lockdown in Liverpool two and a half years ago. Uh, oops, two and a half years ago we had uh, the death in Manchester of Alfie, uh, the little boy, the two and a half year old boy. It takes two and a half years. Uh, I don't have it on here. Um, I haven't written it on this, but it, it takes two, exactly two and a half years ago, the age he was killed, suffocated as Cali cancer, mother suffocates, can't breathe. And now Liverpool shuts down. Venus rules Omega, Libra, and Mars rules Alfie, Alpha, Aries, Aleph, Tau. Because Aries and Taurus close at the bottom of the Saltis. And this is them bringing up Catch-22, Tab, the end of the Hebrew alphabet, 2020. Every two and a half years, Venus does a retro to do a retro petal in the sky. She does five petals, five Olympic rings every eight years. Venus does a five-petal flower. Aleph is Aries, Mars, and Tab is Catch-22, Taurus. Venus rules the five-petal flower, heart, gateway, or trapped in 5G, fifth all-seeing eye. You are meant to pop the fifth, fifth 5G wave. The Alfie Evans case was a legal case in 2018 involving Alfie James Evans. This is um, Wales, the dragon, uh, bringing up the red, white and green, the Tuscany, the last tusk, Seron, the rhinoceros uh, of this. This is the last tusk. We've got the moon for the election. And we've just had that last black moon, uh, that last full moon on Halloween at midnight in Virgo. So this is really turning, yeah, using that Virgo girl, killing England. And uh, 
ending, you see the uh, linen from uh, was in Manchester, Liverpool, and this is why bin uh, this is why Mohammed bin Salman uh, has bought U Manchester United Football Club, which is red and white, so he adds the green. He adds the green, and he is the Moby Dick, the monster. Uh, as I've said before, Israel, Palestine, the gates into Saudi Arabia, uh, England has been bought. Uh, the England has been sold. There's going to be Europe and Saudi Arabia. So uh, obviously we're not going to let this happen. We're bringing heaven to earth. I'm just showing you their evil plans. And so you can see through the deception because they're going to be selling you the climate change uh, the agenda 21 to 30. <clears throat> so this is it. See, so our, uh, it was the cotton industry. It was the East Indian Company. It was the port of Manchester, Liverpool, that they so were ending the cycle of Pluto, 244 years, and here they're now closing down in Liverpool. The masks are just all part of a ritual for bringing us into this new age. But the last trumpet is definitely going to be this end of this triple goddess. Uh, and we've got the last horn. So we've got the triple. This is the last leg. And as we know, that last leg is really when we open the lotus flower and Scorpio comes with Libra and merges back on the Saltis. But they are bringing up Lucifer, uh, this tusk, this minotaur, um, through this ability with the full moon between the two black moons to give us the tusks of the bully and the rhinoceros, uh, Lucifer in Libra. And we're going to have Mercury on the same time on Spica. We had the black moon on Spica. Uh, this is just so enormous. And um, so this election, the 3rd of November, is really it. And Halloween is that pumpkin pumpkin night. Okay, darlings, that was 12 minutes. I love you. Bye.